Hello, barbecue family. Today we're going to do something very appetizing. Uh, make for a nice appetizer. What I got is I got this ribeye spinalis. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pound this out. That way I can make some uh, pinwheels. And so first thing I'm going to do, is we're going to pound this thing out and then I'll show you what we're going to do to make it even better. All right, barbecue family. So as you can see, I got done beating my meat, pounding out this piece of uh, spinalis, otherwise known as ribeye cap. We're gonna try something a little bit different today. I'm gonna use my good friend Sterling, his what's up your beef, you know, just to change things up from uh, the burnt beef, but I'm gonna use the all world famous best rub on the planet, SA, as my first layer as usual. Uh, you know, as you know, I like to spray a little duck fat down first and I'm just gonna put a nice coat of this SA and put a little what's your beef on there next. Didn't have it ready, it's okay. I'm gonna let that set in, flip it over to the other side as you can see, I got some chopped vegetables here. I got shallots, mushrooms, garlic, onions, and a little serrano. You can leave the serrano out if you like. I just like a little kick and I like the flavor of serrano. We're gonna saute these all up, get them nice and soft, use them to roll into here. But right now, I'm gonna go light up some fogo and get this pit fired up. See you outside. Alright guys, now that we got both sides of this uh, ribeye cap seasoned with SA and what's your beef by my good friend Sterling Smith, we got all the vegetables sauteed up, ready to go. We're going to lay it all out, roll it up, use this skewer to hold it together. Let's get it done. We got this thing rolled up. This pit barrel is going good. See how well this thing's gonna hold together and cook for us. This thing's coming along nicely. Looks like it's almost done. Yeah, it's done. We're gonna pull it off. See how it tastes. All right, barbecue family. This thing looks delicious. I foresee the only issue uh, is maintaining uh, its integrity as far as staying together. But we'll see how it works here. I know no matter what, it's gonna be delicious. So let's slice it up a little bit. I got my Ryland uh, serrated knife here. I think it'd work great to Look at that got goodness all the way through there Well as you can see got sliced up and actually stayed together pretty nicely a uh, little medium rare right there in the middle just like I was hoping for and uh, so here's the test let's take a bite that's a very good bite 
You got, uh, of course, the spinalis, which is the best part of the ribeye. Nice and tender, the most flavorful part of the ribeye, in my opinion. Uh, the SA and the What's Your Beef worked greatly together. All those vegetables that we sauteed in the butter with some SA on it complimented the bite. Uh, only thing I would do different is I'd get a bigger piece of spinalis. That way we'd have more pieces to eat. Try this at home, like this video, share it with your friends. Have a great day. Let the smoke keep on rolling.